Good morning, boys and girls. Today, our topic is compare and arrange numbers. Compare maksudnya banding. Arrange maksudnya menyusun. Alright. Now, look at example one. The diagram below shows the Iban population in four districts. Maksudnya, jadul, uh, gambar raja ini menunjukkan bilangan penduduk orang Iban di empat daerah. The first one is Lawas. Lawas 1,105. The second one is Lubuk Antu 12,172. The third one, Bintulu. 75,141. And the last one, Cebu, 69,580. How to compare? Bagaimana nak banding nombor? Okay. Now, we normally will use these two words. More than. Or less than. Dan kita akan guna dua perkataan ini. More than maksudnya uh, lebih banyak. Less than maksudnya kurang daripada. Lebih daripada, kurang daripada. Okay. Let's look at this place value chart. Tengok place value chart ni. Jadual ini. Okay. We start from the right side. Kita selalunya akan isi dari... Uh, kanan okay. Place value For the pla place value Okay, ones, tens After tens, hundreds Thousand and ten Thousand Alright, sekarang Bila nak banding nombor Kita boleh guna place value chart ini Kita boleh isikan Nombor tu ke dalam Okay, look at number one Lawas So, lawas is 1105, right? So, I will start from here. 5. After that, 0. 1. 1. Next, lubuk antu. Lubuk antu, okay, I will start from here also. From 1, 2, 7, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Next one, bintulu. Bintulu, one, four, one, five, seven. Okay, and the last one, Cebu, zero, eight, five, nine, six. Okay, when you already fill in, now we start to compare. Kita nak mula banding nombor. Okay, now look at Lawas. Look at Lawas. We have only four digit until thousand, right? Until thousand. The rest, another three is already until ten thousand. So this one Lawas will be the smallest. Lawas ni akan menjadi yang paling kecil. Alright, paling kecil saya letakkan nombor satu. I will write number one for the smallest. Paling kecil. Okay. We left another three. Lubo Antu, Bintulu and Sibu. Now, we start from 10,000 place. Kita mula dari tempat 10,000. 1, 7, 6. Which is the smallest digit? Yang manakah digit yang paling kecil? Of course, one, right? So, yang kedua, ialah, dubuk antu. Next one, kita tinggal bintulu and sibu. Kita tinggal bintulu dengan sibu. Let's look at the 10,000 place, 7 and 6. Which is the smallest? Which is smaller? 7 or 6? Of course, 6, right? Okay, so this is number 3 and this is number 4. Okay, yang saya susun ini dari kecil ke besar. Okay, now come to here. A. 
69,580 Okay, now I need to compare these two numbers Saya kena banding dua nombor ini Okay So, I will look at 12,000 is lubo antu This one And 69,000 is sibu Alright So, 12,000 is more than Or less than Yang mana lebih kecil 12,000 lebih kecil kan? Yang lubuk antu ni lebih kecil kan? Alright. So, dekat sini kita akan tulis less than. Maksudnya, 12,172 is less than. Kurang daripada 69,580. Now, B. B75,000 is bintulu. Compare with 1,105 compare with lawas. Okay, sekarang bintulu dekat depan kan? Bintulu more ke less kalau banding dengan lawas. Of course, more kan? Sebab lawas ni paling kecil. So, this one I will write here more than. Maksudnya lebih daripada. And C, C we compare among bintulu. And lubuk antu. Kita nak banding antara bintulu dengan lubuk antu. Okay, yang kat depan ni apa? Bintulu. Bintulu, right? Bintulu is the biggest, yang paling besar. So, this is more than. And the last one, 1,105. Ini adalah lawas compare with sibu. Banding dengan sibu. Lawas ialah the smallest Yang paling kecil Jadi bila banding dengan sibu Kita akan tulis Less than Kurang daripada Okay Sekarang tengok bawah Look at the this one Now we, re, we need to arrange the numbers in Ascending order Ascending Ascending Tengok A Huruf A. Kalau A, okay. Maksudnya, macam ni. A and then B, C, D. Maksudnya, menaik, increasing. Okay. Kalau D pula, decreasing, D, right? Kalau D pula, is like this. We start from D and then go to C. B, A. Maksudnya, menurun. D to A is menurun. Decreasing maksudnya menurun. Maksudnya, nombor tu dari paling besar ke paling kecil. From the small, the biggest number to the smallest number. Okay, for ascending. For ascending, I can just follow this. Because just now, I already arrange in. I already arranged from the smallest to the biggest number. Okay, so for ascending, I just write number one is one one zero five, comma, and then number two is one two one seven two. The third one will be Cebu, six nine five eight zero, and the biggest, yang paling besar. Seven five one four one. For descending is very easy. Okay, terbalikkan saja. Okay, yang paling besar seven five one four one. Continue by six nine five eight zero, and one two one seven two, and the smallest one one zero five. Okay, look at next one. Example number two. Example number two. Arrange the numbers in ascending and descending orders. Okay, sama juga arrange, susun, ascending and descending. Kita kena buat ascending dulu, lepas tu descending. Ascending A, A, B, C, D. From the smallest to the biggest. 
Okey, sekarang tanpa menggunakan place value chart, kita juga boleh banding nombor. Okey, the first one, we check the the numbers of digit. Kita tengok bilangan digit. This is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 5 digit numbers. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 5 also. This one, 1, 2, 3, 4. 4 digit sahaja. 4 digit. This is 5 also. Right? So, the 4 digits will be the smallest. Yang paling kecil adalah 4 digit. Labelkan 1. And then, left another 3 numbers. Tinggal 3 nombor. Kita start compare. We start to compare from the 10,000 place. This is 4, 4, 4. Same. Sama. Now, we check the 1,000 place. Kita check 1,000 place. This is 5, 7, 7. Okay, 5, 7, 7. Yang 5 ni lebih kecil kan? Lebih kecil, so saya labelkan number 2. Next, tinggal lagi dua nombor. Okay. Now, we forward to 100 place. Kita pergi ke tempat 100. 1 dengan 2. So, of course, 1 lebih kecil. So, this is number 3 and this is the biggest, paling besar, number 4. So, ascending, ascending, ambil yang kecil ke besar. 4, 5, 2, 0. Number 2, 4, 5, 0, 0, 2. Number 3, 4, 7, 1, 2, 0. And the last one, 4, 7, 2, 8, 8. For descending, biggest to smallest. So, terbalikkan saja. 4, 7, 2, 8, 8. 4, 7, 1, 2, 0. 4, 5, 0, 0, 2. And the smallest, 4, 5, 2, 0. Seterusnya, tengok example 3. Complete this with any possible numbers. Lengkapkan uh, nombor di bawah dengan mana-mana nombor yang mungkin. Possible numbers maksudnya nombor yang mungkin. So, A, kamu tengok. Ini 68,052, 68,119. Maksudnya dia semakin bertambah, meningkat. So, what? Are the possible numbers that can you fill in the bracket? Only one. You choose only one. Isi satu nombor saja. Kita boleh ambil nombor antara 68,119 dengan 68,125. Apakah nombor antara dua nombor ini? Okey, saya listkan. 6, 8, 1, 2, 0. Betul? And then ada juga 6, 8, 1, 2, 1. Boleh juga kan? 6, 8, 1, 2, 2. Boleh juga. Masih boleh. Okay. 6, 8, 1, 2, 3. Masih boleh. Ini 1, 2, 5 kan? So, one more. 6, 8, 1, 2, 4. So, you just choose one number only. Antara banyak-banyak ni, awak cuma pilih satu saja. So, I choose 6, 8, 1, 2, 1. That's all. Okay, for B, for B, now we check this too. 70,058, 70,110. Maksudnya bertambah, meningkat juga, right? So, sekarang cari nombor antara 70,051 dengan 70,058. So, there are many numbers also. You can write 70052. Betul? Sampai 58 kan? Okay. 70053, 70054, 70055, 70056, and 70057. Sampai 58. Alright. So, now you choose only one number. Pilihlah nombor yang kamu suka. For example, I choose this one. 70055. That's all.